Hey guys, how's it going? So this is, we did faces, we did a standing person, then we did a person with a house. So this is like the fourth lesson. We're gonna call this transportation one. Okay, it's gonna be just a simple car, then like a drag racing car and a plane. Um, don't draw this rectangle, right? That's your paper. First thing you should draw is a line to ground. And technically this is called, you don't have to write this word, but you should know that it's called the baseline. Okay? You should get used to not starting your drawings using the bottom of the paper as the ground. Okay? I may have said that before to you, but here comes a simple car. I know you guys can do all this. So they've got two circles. That's simple, right? Draw two smaller circles in there. Then I'm gonna connect them with a line. I'm gonna turn that into a rectangle. I'm gonna continue like this. Okay. Now I'm gonna draw a trapezoid on top. That's just a fancy way of saying there are two lines that are slanted towards each other. And then we're gonna flatten it out. Okay. I'm gonna draw a roof on the car. Add a few details here. Bumpers, right? Headlight. Uh, we'll put a divider here. Draw a real simple person in there. Okay, so that's a real simple car that I'm sure you guys can all do, right? This one's gonna be a little harder. These get progressively harder, a little harder, a little harder. The back wheel, I hope I got enough room here. I'm gonna I'm gonna extend my paper. <laughs> Magic. All right, here you go. I want you to draw a really big tire back here. And you know I'm not crazy about that. Watch this. I've got a way I like for it to look. Yeah, there we go. With a smaller hole in the middle. It's a lot of rubber, right? To grab the road. Up here we got a small tire, because it's a drag racer, okay? Now, just like this, we're gonna connect them with a line, ready? Like that. We're gonna use a triangle for the body shape though, ready? I'm gonna come out, I'm gonna go up like this, and then down, and then I'm gonna imagine that I went over, all right? Here we go, here's where the driver sits. We're gonna draw a U here, and then we're gonna erase that. Hit that. Now I'm going to draw some spoilers up here. A couple of parallel lines that are diagonal with what I call, this is a great shape to know, raindrop shape, teardrop shape, but we're going to draw it this way. Okay, that's the stabilizer on the back. All right. You got to pick your favorite number though now because every race car needs a number on it. So I'm going to put eight on it. I like to do eight. Try to make it a block letter. If you can. So there's a number. All right. I'm going to put a little dude in here driving. Kind of like that one, but a little more complicated. That's the body is a half circle. A bit of an arm. Here comes a race helmet. I'm drawing small with chalk. You could probably draw it a little easier. A line, then you come down like a U. And when, then you're going to connect these two spots, right? With a semicircle. We're going to give them some goggles, which is like a semicircle. Or a letter D, maybe. Draw it again. Straps. Jaw, a little bit of a neck. Okay, so there's your race car driver. I'm gonna put a couple of stripes up here. Racing stripes. Now, if the next part's too hard, you can skip it, like if you're in middle school, but I think you could probably do it. It's uh, the mufflers on the car. Watch this, you come down like this, you draw a semicircle, right? That's a semicircle. Then we're gonna come down and go back and you put a circle on the end of there. Erase this. That's the exhaust pipe, right? Then you do it again. One, down, back, semicircle. 
full circle. Semicircle, line down, back, circle. Okay, technically they should have four on each side because it's a eight cylinder car. There you go. There you have your drag racer, okay? Um, the last one's gonna be a biplane, old fashioned kind of plane, okay? So we're gonna do it up here. I'm gonna start with a rectangle. Then we're gonna draw a triangle off the back of that. All right, and I know you guys can all draw that. And then we're gonna add a circle on there. Okay, so we're almost done. That's like the hard part right there. We're gonna use that teardrop shape to make the wing. And the word bi means two. So if it's a biplane, the second wing goes a little bit forward and it's up in the air. It's not connected to the body directly. It's held up there by some steel rods, right? So here's the steel rods. Now I'm gonna erase this line. We don't need that anymore. Okay. I'm gonna draw the engine cover. It comes up a little bit. It's rounded on the front. It comes down, watch, it's rounded again. Okay. We're gonna draw half of an oval in the center. Like that. It's what the propeller is attached to. And for the propeller, again, you get to use those raindrop shapes. Like that. Like that. The wheels were always down on these planes. We're gonna draw like this. Like that. The axle in the middle. All right, now we're gonna put the pilot again sitting up here, cockpit, we're going to go down and around. The pilot's going to be drawn the same way except we're going to add a scarf on it. So like here's the arm with the body, okay? Draw the helmet, a line, and a U, and then connect it with a semicircle. All right, add some curve for the it's getting small with my chalk. Those are the goggles, the jaw, and here it comes. Yeah, if you ever saw Snoopy and the Red Baron, right? You got a nice scarf there. And we should give it a symbol. Back in the day, they used to use a bullseye, a red, white, and blue bullseye. So here's your red circle. It's gonna be white, it's gonna be blue in the center. I'm gonna put it back here too. You'd also have a tiny wing back here to help you steer. And you'd also would have a tiny wheel back here, okay, for when it lands. It can drive around a little bit. And that is your car, race car, and biplane. And what I'd like you to do, too, then, is color it a little bit. Here's one that's colored. I did not color the car on purpose. Okay, so here's your drag racer your biplane, okay. So have fun with that, okay. Thank you guys.